my hook. Hook gave way, I should say. Oh, but that's so close to working. That just needs to be tricked out a little bit. go secure the thing in place. I'm using these little guys here to secure them in, uh, actually, uh, well, secure, I guess secure, I'm just overusing the word secure, I guess I'm secure today, uh, to actually screw them into the galvanized pipe, and then this just expands the force so it holds it all in place, and you put a few of these in and it stays up. Way better than the hooks. That was a lot better than the first side. <clears throat> it took me, what, three, four tries to get it over? Uh, to get it up to the top and secure the other side? Holy system's definitely the way to go. Uh, so I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to get to work on the other one. on the north side, so now I'm working on uh, the vent on the uh, south side, getting this piece in. Then I only got four more pieces after this one. It's coming along nicely. Well, I got all the uh, insulation up on the wall. I got some banding put in front of it here to hold it if in case the wind blows this way, everything else is up. Uh, right now what I'm doing is I'm trimming the bottom and I'm raising it up off the floor so there's not an easy way for mice and critters and stuff to sneak up into the insulation. So I'm putting like two, three inches off the bottom of the floor. And I'm just taking my razor blade knife and cutting it off. So I haven't shown you this yet, but uh, what I'm doing is I'm taking 
instead of putting long strips out, which are pretty hard for me to handle by myself, uh, I'm doing small strips like this, and I'm putting them in quite a few places, quite a, quite a few of them everywhere. And what I do is just do this right here on the table. I'm wearing the glove because if it, uh, if the screw grabs it all into the metal and twists it, it's like a razor blade. And these have been really quite successful. Uh, as you've been watching me putting them in, you know, it's kind of the thing that makes this all happen. There we go. Whew. Whew. Well, that is another really long full day's worth of work. Uh, went up way better using the pulley system. Uh, really happy with that. And it's all done. We've got the east side insulated. Been out here all day. Uh, I have noticed that the heater's running a little less. I don't have a timer on it. That The data is all back on the server, so I can go check that out uh, later to see how big of impact these things are having. But you can definitely tell it's running just probably a few minutes, like five minutes less maybe. But hey, five minutes. That adds up over the course of the day, right? You know, that's, that ends up being serious money. So uh, I'll happily take five minutes if that's all it is. Um, let me show you how it came out. Go mobile here. This is looking to the north. Now all of this is gonna get covered in insulation as well. So that'll all be insulated. I'm gonna start on that maybe tomorrow. Here we got the inlet outlet, turned out real nice. And got the inlet outlet there. Everything came out really I got nice. it all trimmed up. Uh, everything came out looking really good. Really happy with this side. Happy with the other side as well. Uh, for not knowing what I'm doing, uh, I think we figured out something that's definitely good enough. I don't think this is probably the most professional way to do it. Uh, so I would not recommend that people do everything that I'm doing. But certainly if you've never done it before, this could be a good video to kind of say, well, this is one way to do it, I guess. But anyway, uh, I'm really tired. So uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and end it here. Thanks so much for following along. Really appreciate everybody and your comments. Oh, um, I haven't been able to reply to comments lately or emails. I'm just swamped. Honestly, I'm just swamped. So uh, that doesn't mean I don't want you to comment. I, I love it when people comment and you guys have kind of discussions on there of your own and pass on ideas. That's what this is all for. So other people, you can share your ideas here on the Real Martian YouTube channel. Uh, so please do comment, um, good and bad. Uh, you know, obviously we've been through a lot, so I've, uh, I take the good with the bad all the time. Take the bad with your good. Obviously I'm tired. So on that note, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter. In the meantime, this is The Real Martian, out.